Hello, welcome to the Eternal Tribute channel and in this video we came to bring a list of famous celebrities who ended up dying in the last 24 hours. But first leave your like and subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with the latest news from the world of celebrities, so let's go straight to John Savident. Actor John Savident, best known for playing Fred Elliott in Coronation Street, has died aged 86, his agent has announced. The actor was famous for his booming voice while playing the local butcher on the ITV soap, his co-star Sue Nichols, who played love interest Audrey Roberts, said she was very sad to hear of his death. My memories of working with you dear John on the street are a joy, and always will be, she added. God bless you and thank you for being in my life. Much love to you and your friends and family. Savadon joined the Manchester-based soap in 1994 and quickly became a favorite with viewers thanks to his huge personality and loud voice. His storylines involved his disastrous love life, including three marriages and several failed proposals. A secret son, Ashley Peacock played by Stephen Arnold, also arrived on the show and the two later developed a close bond as they worked as butchers together. Savadon's character was killed off in 2006, suffering a stroke on the day he was supposed to marry B.V. Onwin Susie Blake. Elliot's death also saw Roberts, his former romantic interest, confess she still loved him following her turning down his proposal of marriage years previously. The Butcher's other previous wives were Maureen Holdsworth, Sherry Hewson, and barmaid Eve Sykes' Melanie Kilburn, one of Elliot's most distinctive character traits was that he often said things twice, usually inserting the words I say between them, for example, best of British is that. I say best of British, even in his death scene, Elliot said to Onwen, be happy, I say, be happy. Born in Guernsey in 1938 to a local fisherman father and a Swiss mother, Savadent and his family left the Channel Islands, then under German occupation, and moved to Ashton under Lyne, Greater Manchester. When he was three, he started his career as a policeman in Manchester and during his six years of service was stabbed in the arm as he tried to break up a gang fight. Initially pursuing his acting ambitions in amateur productions, Savadon quit the force when a producer overheard him talking in a pub and offered him a part as Robin Hood in a London panto, launching his acting career, Savadon was married to theater director Rona Hopkinson and they had two children, Stuart Organ. The Grange Hill actor Stuart Organ has died aged 72, his representative has confirmed. The British actor was best known for playing the firm but fair Peter Robson in the children's TV drama and was the longest serving member of staff at the school. Organ died peacefully at home after a short illness. It was announced on Friday. As Robson, he was a PE and geography teacher who was promoted to head teacher in the series about life in a London comprehensive school. The show ran from 1978 to 2008 and made headlines for its gritty social realism, tackling issues such as racism, drug abuse, teenage pregnancy, mental illness, and HIV and AIDS. His agent, Creative Artists Management, said. Stewart was a magnificent actor with a wonderful career on stage and screen. Best known for playing Mr. Robson in Grange Hill, he was a true gentleman and a delight to work with and will be much missed. Organ also portrayed Kevin Cross in the TV show Brookside and featured in other shows including Doctor Who, where he appeared alongside Sylvester McCoy. His career also included appearances in the medical dramas Casualty and Holby City and a number of films including Those Glory Glory Days, The Festive Film Present Spirits, and Fork in the Road. Organ started his professional career at Leeds Playhouse in 1975 in a performance of Tom Stoppard's Rosencrantz and Guildenstern Are Dead, a spin-off of William Shakespeare's Hamlet, and would also tread the boards as Judge Turpin in Queen's Theatre Hornchurch's Sweeney Todd. Grange Hill made household names of characters such as Zamo Maguire, played by Lee MacDonald, and Tucker Jenkins, played by Todd Carty. Shin Seidong Tiger Producer Shin Seidong Tiger, also known by his birth name Lee Ho Yang, 
was found dead on Friday, 23, at the age of 41. The artist signed a series of K-pop hits and was responsible for creating the girl group Tri.be in 2001. The death was revealed by the artist's agency, TR Entertainment. According to the team, Shin Sedong was found lifeless in his studio, but there are still no details about the cause of death. Sources in the music industry told South Korean news portal The Korean Herald that the producer was found after not answering a series of calls on his cell phone. Throughout his career, the producer worked alongside influential K-pop artists, especially female singers. He signed 4 Minutes Hot Issue, T. Eras Roly Poly, Yek Sides Up and Down and Momoland's Boom Boom, Wilson Fittipaldi. Brazilian motorsport is once again in mourning. Approximately two months after the loss of Gil de Ferran, Wilson Fittipaldi JRB, former Formula One driver and creator of Capersicar, died at around 6 a.m. this Friday 23 at the age of 80. Wilson had been in the Sancta Maggiore Hospital in Itaim Bibi, Sao Paulo, since December 25. Emerson Fittipaldi's brother suffered a cardiac arrest during Christmas lunch, when he was also celebrating his 80th birthday. Tigro, as he was known, Wilson choked on a piece of meat and remained without oxygen for a long time. The former pilot had a cardiac arrest and was revived in the emergency room. Since then, he had been sedated and intubated. The doctors tried to remove the sedation, but this was not possible at the first attempts because of the constant spasms. At the beginning of January, Fittipaldi showed slight improvement and had the sedation removed by the doctors on the third attempt. Wilson woke up for a few moments but couldn't communicate, and the hospital staff were still waiting to check his neurological condition. After having seizures again, the former driver was sedated again on the 23rd, exactly one month ago. When contacted by Grand Premio, the hospital's press office said that, due to medical confidentiality, it does not share any more information about patients and that this can only be provided by family members. Wilson leaves behind two children, Christian Fittipaldi, a former Formula One and Indy car driver and current motorsport commentator for Disney channels, and Roberta Fittipaldi. An official statement from the family is not expected at this time. Pamela Salem British actor Pamela Salem, who appeared as Bond secretary Miss Moneypenny in the film Never Say Never Again, has died. Salem's agent Maddie Berta Kautz confirmed in a phone call with The Times that the actor died Wednesday at her home in Florida at age 80. Additional details, including a cause of death, were not revealed. She was a friend. She wasn't just a client, Burdett Kautz said. We've been friends for a long time, so it is all a bit raw. She was just the most lovely person. British production and publishing company Big Finish announced Salem's death in a news release Friday. Everyone at Big Finish was shocked and saddened to learn about the passing of our friend and colleague Pamela Salem, the release read, before sharing the details of Salem's life and career. Big Finnish contributor David Richardson, who produced Salem's various audio dramas, remembered the actor's work ethic and warm personality. She was a very gentle person always interested in everyone, from her co-stars to the production team to the guest actors and visitors, he said in the release. She talked with joy about her home on Miami Beach, waking up to warmth and waves, and she knew all about our lives and families and life stories. Salem, who was born in 1944 in India, touts a screen career spanning multiple decades starting from the late 1960s and ending just before 2020, according to IMDb. Among the most notable of her projects, however, is a turn as secretary Miss Moneypenny opposite Sean Connery's James Bond in the unofficial Bond film Never Say Never Again in 1983. Salem's legacy also includes appearances in nine episodes of the original Doctor Who series. Her time on the beloved Sci-Fi series informed the multiple audio drama projects she pursued with Big Finish in the years before her death. The actor's more substantive television work also included British series Buccaneer, Into the Labyrinth and EastEnders, 
Her additional TV credits include French Fields and appearances on U.S. dramas Er, The West Wing, and Big Love. Salem's film credits include 1978 E's The Great Train Robbery, also alongside Connery, Salem, Gods and Monsters, and April's Shower. Salem grew up in England and attended Germany's Heidelberg University and London's Royal Central School of Speech before commencing her acting career with repertory theater in Chesterfield and York. In the 90s, she moved overseas and settled in Los Angeles and eventually Miami. She was married to Irish actor Michael O'Hagan, who died in 2017 at age 77. Salem is survived by her sister, puppeteer and poet Gail Robick. I ask you to join us in praying for Dam Vin Hung. Singer Dam Vin Hung was hospitalized following a fall on stage during a performance in Orange County, California, resulting in several stitches to his right foot. The mishap occurred as he attempted to step onto a fountain amidst dancers, causing a significant injury that necessitated immediate medical attention. I'm exhausted and in a lot of pain, the singer said. The doctors had to give me many stitches and they said the wound would cause me a lot of trouble walking. I'll need a month of rest for a full recovery. The incident has disrupted Dam Vin Hung's preparation for his upcoming show and gay M. Thap Sao Troy, a day you lit up the stars scheduled for March. As a result, the shows in H.O. Kai Min City and Hanoi have been postponed to May 4th and May 18th, respectively. I apologize for the unexpected rescheduling. I hope everyone can understand. I'll focus on recovering quickly so I can see dear friends and fans soon, said the singer. He also assured that refunds would be provided for those unable to attend the rescheduled dates. Hung, 53, hails from Kuangnam province and is a father to four-year-old Polo Hine, with the identity of the mother remaining private.